Hi guys, welcome back to Lennox Many channel. Hit that like, hit that favorite button. Follow me on YouTube. If you're not following me, same name, Lennox Many. Let's go. Alright, so we are looking at an equal matrices and what it says A is equal to x3 negative 2, y B is equal to negative 1, 2, 5, and 6, while C is equal to 10, A, B, and 14. And they gave us the rule, which is A, B is equal to C, and they asked us to find A, B, X, and Y. Pause the video and try. Alright, let's go. So A, B means A times B, so we just write back A, which is X. 3 negative 2 and y and of course we're gonna times it by b b is negative 1 2 5 and 6 and of course we're gonna equate that to c which is 10 a b and 14 so we're gonna cut up the first one in rows because that's how we multiply matrices it's row by column we're gonna try to go as slow as possible all right so x times one that would give us negative x three times five that would give us 15. we're done with this row onto this column now row one column two x times two that's two x x times 3 times 6 which is 18 negative 2 times negative 1 that's positive 2 y times 5 definitely 5y row 2 column 2 so negative 2 times that that would give us minus 4 y times 6 definitely 6y so now we're going to equate it to all of this which is equal to 10, A, B, and 14. All right, what this actually means, we're going to equate the corresponding. So all of this is going to equal to 10. Same position, right? 2x plus 8 is going to equal to that. And 2y plus 5y is going to equal to B. And negative 4 plus 6y, 14. So it's the position. So let's wrap it up. So we have negative x plus 15, and that must equal to, I'm right with all these first, 2 plus 5y is equal to b, 2x plus 18 equal to a, and the final one, negative 4 plus 6y equal to 14. All right, so all of these is corresponding. This must equal to 10. 2x plus 18 is equal to a. I wrote that already. I'm going to this. And of course, this must equal to b. 2x plus 5y. So guys, what you're going to do, you're going to look and see which one has the one unknown. And of course, it will be this x. So we can solve for x right away because there's only one unknown. This is a plus 15, so we minus 15 from both sides. And of course, x works out to negative cancel negative 5. So the value of x is 5. So now that we know x is 5, we can actually solve for this one right here. 2 times 5 plus 18 is equal to a. So 2, 5, 10 plus 18. Therefore, a is equal to 28. So we get A and we get, let us get our X now. So this is minus 4. So what we're going to do, add 14 to this side. And of course, 14 plus 14, 14 plus 4 rather, is going to give us 18. And we divide by 6. So therefore, Y is 3. So we know that Y is 3 now. So guess what? Can you ever see Y? We put 3. Now we this 5 3 is 15, so therefore y e, b is equal to 15 plus 2, which is 17. Guys, see the number here for call. We're getting this awesome online classes, alright? Spaces are limited, so do it fast, guys. Do it fast. Marathon's coming up too. 
Alright, so guys, I'm Lennox Penny Tomorrow. I will see you guys in another video.